All right, everybody, welcome back to an evening with Piss and Chris. Uh, this is Chris here. How you doing, Piss? Pretty darn good, dude. You know, we had, uh, I don't know, maybe a slightly bumpy start to the show this evening, but Piss and I have been talking about it. We decided to ramp this up into overdrive. Oh, Piss has helped yeah. us out a little bit. By the way... Piss totally redeemed himself just now, by yeah, the way. Yeah, I had to redeem myself. Uh, but as I think most of our, our valued listeners will uh, re- will remember, we have a very particular meme that we hold, or a, a gif, really, that is our gift to you, the world. Uh, and that would be the boobs gif that we have on the show. Boob gift to <laughs> milkers return. God, look at how much moisture comes off the bottom there. She is that is, <laughs> she's just emptying them out. <laughs> what? Oh my so god! This chick like straightened out her swimsuit, and this kid thinks she's milking herself. No, I'm saying there's just like so much titty action going on there that's great anyway all right so, we'll come back to these yeah we'll no that was uh this. that's just uh that was my pick for uh awesome boob gif number two <laughs> all right back to annoying facebook chick taking college level english class still talks like this to you on facebook ha ha <laughs> what, what what do you think about that one piss Oh, uh, that one's uh. So, what do you think about that? No, yeah, that's a. That was yeah. All these are always kind of. Oh, thirty status was about Obama. <laughs> Never voted. Yep. I, don't, I don't agree with that. I mean, it's like these are gay, but you also I know at like least five chicks. Exactly. Somebody like fought that. for me in the past, so I don't have to vote. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I got a uh, shit ton of Velociraptor. Nice. I believe you contributed some as well, didn't you? Or, or maybe no, I didn't actually. Okay, Not well, this episode, but I yeah. have every other episode. There's one here. Why don't you read it? Today is the oldest you've ever been, and the youngest you'll ever be again. Mind boggling. This was uh, a meme that was made several years ago <laughs> that uh, was pretty funny when it came out. And Chris has apparently brought it back for new generations. <laughs> I uh, I didn't realize that that was that old. My bad. Okay. <laughs> Have you seen this one before? You if think Cinderella's that's... shoe fit perfectly, why did it fall off? Something to think about. Yeah, that is something to think about. <laughs> That's right, a good little on. mind bender. There you go, a hipster one. This is a crossover of a hipster <laughs> and fucking uh, philosopher. If, if hipsters held a convention, how would anybody find out? <laughs> well, if you go were on. hip, you'd already know about it. Yeah, no kidding. And all, you wouldn't go because cool you know. knew that everybody else would go to it. <laughs> it's not cool if you talk about it, okay? Yep. All right. Would Transformers buy life insurance or car insurance? There I think you go. Car insurance, though. I mean, if you really, if you really thought about it, it's like they need parts, son. I feel like I gotta go. I gotta skip out of Philosopher for just a second to All do right. a, a Transformers reference. <laughs> Masturbation, playing with yourself. <laughs> That's awesome. All right. That was that's I that's pretty tangent. Funny, cool. <laughs> Moving back to Philosopher, here's the last one. What would happen if you hired two private investigators to follow each other? That'd be <laughs> that. If I had a lot of money, that's exactly what I would do. I want you I would to do tell shit this guy. exactly like that. That's so funny. Like this, he can't find out about you. I would tell both of them both. I'd be like, you can't find out. Or you can't let him find out about you. And then just let him go for a couple of weeks. Heads up. 
Heads up, asshole driver alert. Read it out, dude. Everyone is merging. Fuck that, I'm taking the empty lane until the last moment. Some douche will let me in. Hilarious. But I feel like everyone's been there, haven't they? I mean, I'm convicted myself by that I've one. I've done that before. You know, I don't do it every time. But then you got that I mean, dick I've that like, does like I've the fake, s- fake swerve oh, out. Oh, yeah, Jesus. Yeah, you got Cindy, the minivan mom, who thinks she's doing something right for her community. The self-designated traffic. Trying to kill you. God. Anyways. And when I was safely driving 80 miles an hour <laughs> next to... Oh, this one's another classic. Oh, man. This was from, what, 2008, 2009? Fuck you. God I don't think they were even in the double All right, anyways. Yet, that was a good one when it came out. Well, here, let's Here's, read it for people that haven't... Envy. What is it? It wears a coat and hangs out in hallways. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, moving on. Blasphemy. A ticket to hell never has never been funnier. Hilarious. We uh, we hate small type here on fucking an evening of passing grass. It just kills us because uh, we're forced to watch our own show in like a really tiny. Yeah, screen. you guys actually get to watch the show better than we do. So, <laughs> uh, but we make it work because that's what we got. I want to let this one sink in for a little bit. Let it hit the fans. Are those little Wayne or little John? Yeah, yeah it is little John. Isn't he dead? <laughs> Not yet. Uh, at least his career is anyway. Oh, hey, look, kids, a falling star. Okay. Here's an old one, and I'm not sure. Did we already have this one on the show? Or I can't remember. I don't think so. What's the bottom? It says perseverance. Sometimes the wait is worth it. Hilarious. That kid's face is just like, fuck. Oh my God, it's happening. Boobies. (laughs) What'd you say? (laughs) Boobies. All right. Ninjas. They're everywhere. Tell me you've seen this one before. God damn it. I swear it. I sniped this one. This has got to be fresh. See, like that dude's making out with some chick, and then that dude's like sniping in on a straw and drinking, or I guess her drink. Yeah, he's, that's awesome. Yeah, I couldn't see what was going on there. That's fucking awesome. <laughs> that's the cool. That's the coolest one you've had yet, dude. Some guy just drinking some chick's fucking wine cooler. That's funny as hell, dude. Sniper. That competes with the uh, when like. Your friend's hand makes it look like you have a penis. Uh, not not quite that good. That was still fucking. That, that was, was like pretty incredible. Like, there's no category for that. It's just fucking. It's an incredible perspective <laughs> shot. Oh my god, we should definitely. I think we had that on the show uh, a couple of shows ago when we had the when we unleashed the meme vault. Oh my god, heads up. Okay, that that concludes the uh, demotivational section of the uh, show. I forgot to mention. I'm trying to keep these. Oh, right on. Yeah, yeah. In like kind of segments. Yeah. All right. Cool. I I like that. I appreciate that. Yeah. No. It's you're totally welcome. Uh, I would like to also welcome you to the next segment. You see see that? That was a real smooth transition there. Anyways, that's what we call a segue. Yeah. A segue. Oh, it's like a segment segue. Okay, um, this is uh, the cat. Funny cat? I don't know. It's just entertaining funny cat. cat. Here's a funny cat gif. It seems like people like this stuff. Oh, that's funny. Click yeah. yes if you enjoy this kind of shit. That is... Oh, so he's... Okay, that's fucking awesome. I love cat gifs. Cats are really like if any if internet's proven anything, it's that cats are the funniest animals. Dogs are kind of stupid and lanky or whatever, but cats are truly the funniest animals. That's true, piss. That's extremely true. Yeah, and every time I turn on the camera, the monitor behind us is turned off. <laughs> Hilarious. We're trying to go all high tech and like we have this like it's a pretty big screen, but then we like look at it on camera <laughs> and it's like really tiny. Really look at that. Really tiny. Wait, dude, that's like a 26, son. 26, son. 
It's like that, son. Yeah. It's a big screen for show. Yeah, it's I know. Minecraft it's screen. It's totally big, but it's like if you ever really wonder, far uh, away. If you ever wonder what planet Minecraft... Wow, I totally fucked that up. If you ever wonder what Radio Minecraft is run on, it's that very screen. <laughs> That's right, it uh, is. I spent all day on Planet Minecraft today, uh, totally fucking repping the cruise ship and all sorts of stuff, man. Put a bunch of Doc Dre skins up there. Pimping out. Yeah, dude, that's awesome. <laughs> that That is great, dude. What was that? That That is a new... Seizure cat, dude. That is Seizure cat. It's Cosmos Seizure cat. Dude, that's amazing. I way approve of that shit. That's funny as fuck. So, uh, yeah. Tell us something interesting about yourself, Piss. Actually, hey, we actually have facts. Yeah, uh, we got some I, cool shit. Yeah, so let me... Uh, you can see stars during the day from the bottom of a well. That's pretty interesting. I wonder how that works. But I, I'll buy it. <laughs> <laughs> Just rip ass. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, that was amazing. I hope the audience was able to hear that. That was like a sharp one, too. Sounded sharp. <laughs> you would have to drink a hundred cups of coffee in four hours to get the lethal dose of caffeine, which is ten grams. Ten grizzams. Yeah. We All like right. to spell it out. Apparently, before toilet paper, before toilet paper, people would wipe their butts with fruit skins. Wow. And I can't imagine like That'd every awesome, time you wiped, kind of, yeah. I mean, but I can't imagine every time you wiped your ass with uh, fruit skin. There was, there's got to be some other times where you're just like hand wiping, where there was a cloth oh, you used. Oh God! You just belch that into just your mic. Stinks so bad. I bet it does. Oh, it smells, it smells like, like Chinese food, and it's just stuck dreams. in my. Oh. You can actually my uh, apparently vomit your feces if your intestines are backed up enough. Holy Christ! Isn't that fucking awful? Um, women with hourglass figures tend to be more fertile. So when you're out there banging chicks tonight, use that as a piece of guidance. A they way tend or to two. be more fertile. Yeah. Oh fuck, dude! This is this is tits. Flamingos get their pink color from the shrimp they eat, and really, and the more shrimp that they eat. The darker pink they become. That's very interesting. I, I did not know that. That's wow. I wonder if people could do the same thing. That would You'd be wonder why cool. why rabbits aren't just like fucking orange as shit. Hey, here's an interesting one. Uh, studies show that listening to music is good for digestion, and I would totally agree with that. Uh, Chris and I talk about that all the time. It's like. You can do whatever you want in the morning, and then as soon as you get in your car and start listening to some fat beats, you just gotta <laughs> you gotta let one rip. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Damn. So uh, music is good for digestion. It's proven in studies now. Holy shit! I think. Oh man, we almost gotta like test this next one. Every episode of Seinfeld, or in every in every episode of Seinfeld, there is at least one. Superman reference somewhere. And it's like a visual Superman reference. So Really? Somewhere in every single episode of Seinfeld, there is a visual Superman reference. Damn, dude. Did you just rip ass again? You got to catch those oh, yeah. on the mic, dude. Dude, I wish I could. You can't waste those. Dude, mic it, <laughs> bruh. Dude, we don't have the mic technology. If mic I had my other mic bruh. stand, I'd, I'd be able to just, just ridiculously own this. Yeah, I'm. St <laughs> oh, that's fucking fun. Oh god, people like dolphins, right? Yeah, dolphins are uh, pretty status quo. Well, when basically dolphins don't <laughs> automatically breathe. <laughs> oh, you can't smell that. That's fucking awful. I am don't just fucking, choke. I just we made the reference in the last <laughs> the fucking studio. In the last episode, we talked about how small this new oh, studio yeah. is. So if you rip ass, it just chokes out. <laughs> Oh yeah, the whole dude. room so fast. Out. It's it's no good. Yeah, this is a guy show, man. We got to get some uh, get some more kitty on there for girls, cause 
Dude, that's just badass. That, that's audience. definitely my favorite thing of the whole night. Um, so far. That and the boobs. I thought the boobs were pretty cool. <laughs> Tigers have striped skin, not just striped fur. Really? Yeah. That's very extremely true. That's very interesting. Try to say the alphabet without moving your lips or tongue. Every letter should sound exactly the same. Hmm. Apples are more efficient than caffeine in keeping people awake in the morning. Apples. Fuck, dude. I'm going to skip the coffee and eat Dude, we that. might have to switch to some apples. I'm down to try anything. The coffee king of after a while, it just makes you tired. The king of hearts is the only king without a mustache on a standard playing card. Really? I guess I never noticed. I never noticed. Uh, you know, I always thought the kings always had like beards and shit. The Mona Lisa has no eyebrows. It was the fashion in the Renaissance Florence. Damn, to shave off your brows? To shave your eyebrows off. That's fucking weird. Yeah. It's very Tablecloths were originally meant to be served as towels with which dinner guests could wipe their hands and faces after eating. But now it's like, oh my god, you totally spilt on the tablecloth, you asshole. Incredible. Until the 19th century, solid blocks of tea were used as money in oh, Siberia. Yeah. Totally, I've heard of that shit. That's fucking awesome. Really? As a currency? Yeah, as a tea. currency. And that's badass because it's like tea is something that you can hold in your hand and it's it's like tangible money. It's not fiat money, you know? It's something with value that you very can... Very extremely If nothing extreme. else, you could fucking crack it up and full-blow tea it, you know? Uh, a group of geese on the ground is a gaggle. And a group of geese in the air is a skein. Or a flock. I thought it was a gander. What's like good for the goose is good for the gander. But on the ground they're called a gaggle. Huh. A gaggle of geese. A geese gaggle. One gaggle. Sounds like a kegel. It's not a kegel. See, it's not a kegel. It's like a kegel. It's, it's not like a kegel. It's like a kegel. It's not a kegel. <laughs> What door are we talking about here? Pinocchio is Italian for pine eye. Pine eye. That's funny. Good old pine eye. Yeah. It could be like pine nose. Oh, here's one. Piss, our, uh, the host of the show, is a left-handed person. So this one very extremely might true. apply. Over 2,500 left-handed people a year are killed from using products made for right-handed people oh yeah totally if you if you're left-handed you know exactly what i'm talking about when you fucking see those scissors that are made for right-handed people there is nothing that pisses me off more than scissors made for right-handed people it's like totally an object that could be ambidextrous all day long and never have a single problem but yeah they put those giant fucking wells on there so you just destroy your hand if you're lefty it's pretty bad. That and chainsaws and fucking a whole bunch of other products are totally not left-handed friendly. Dude. I feel like being, you know, left-handed is probably, and a white male, probably makes me the most discriminated guy in in, uh, in America. What's up, Chris? Uh, I'm not going to touch that one with a 10-foot pole. You brought race into it, and I, I give that the anti-ding. I'm going to flip my dinger upside down for an anti-ding. No, I'm just saying that more to like the consumer are here on an evening with Chris. I'm pointing piss. that towards I mean, the, the consumer manufacturers. If if you weren't listening to me before, I'm pointing that at the manufacturers so they don't make right-handed scissors because it's unnecessary, and left-handed scissors are impractical. So why would you make right-handed scissors? I guess ambidextrous. Let's live together and cut paper together. <laughs> awesome. A jiffy. Like, you know, when somebody says, I'll be back in a jiffy. Be there in a jiffy. That's an actual unit of time. For how much time does it say? It's one one hundredth of a second. That is a jiffy. Damn, that is... That's pretty fucking quick. I would never make that promise to somebody. Lost monitor again. 
We got it, though. We're back with the monitor. If you counted 24 hours a day, it would take 31,688 years to reach the number one trillion. Damn. <laughs> so that's like a completely ridiculous fact that means absolutely nothing. That's very incredible, though. <laughs> So uh, you know. do we have any more memes left? Or, oh yeah, uh, no, let's totally. bust into some meme dig and see what else couple. we got here. So where did we leave off? I believe we left off at the cute little kitty here. Hey, how are you doing, kitty? Um, so Gotta get out of here. Just claw as well. That puts us somewhere over here next to this kitty. <laughs> This is super anticlimactic jump. <laughs> it's uh, like he couldn't have jumped a less far. <laughs> he like winds up for it too. It's like a huge wind up for zero jump. <laughs> That's so funny. Uh, Geronimo. That's funny as fuck. Bottles of wine. No, wait. One of them is definitely a cat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny as shit. Or that last one's a cat. That last one is definitely a cat. That's a cute kitty. It's a kitty. If not for sits, why is it made for warm? <laughs> or why is it made of warm? <laughs> it's fucking awesome. Yeah, cats, man, they just fucking love laptops and shit. It's funny as hell. Um, nobody's quite explained to me what the deal with cats and memes and why they're more looked at than any famous celebrity or anything online. It's because cats do funny shit, you know? And, uh, you know, people, what is it, anthropomorphize or whatever cats. And so, uh, you know, when you see them in, like, human-esque type scenarios, it's funny as shit. And dogs just don't work as well for that kind of stuff. In real life, I feel like dogs are a lot funnier than cats, but uh, in the photo world, man, cats just got it all day long. Yeah, That's awesome. It's like the super jail version of a cat. That's it's so giddy. funny. Oh. <laughs> Roadrunner kitty. Meep, meep. <laughs> I love those, like, mid-stride. Look at how freaking gnarly that cat's running. Damn, those are, like... I would I would be face-planting in the next frame if that were me. Doosh. It's a Peter Griffin one-frame fall. There you go. This one's for you, Piz. I love you, couch. You understand me. What is that, like a Tempur-Pedic or something? That looks fucking badass. That does look incredible. That looks like exactly what I want to be laying on right now. <laughs> Just a cat being a cat. What does he got there? I, I keep your beers till I gets tuna. <laughs> <laughs> He's like totally... Oh, man, I... I grabbed that picture because, it, I don't know, like, that's amazing that that cat is holding that beer so much like that. That cat, that's got to be totally photoshopped. It looks photoshopped as shit from back here. Yeah, I mean, I stopped giving a shit a while ago, so, like, I can't tell. I haven't photoshopped in a while. I haven't been oh, shopping yeah? in a while, so my skills, that. they're a little bit off. Looks like that's been shopped. I'm pretty sure that, yeah, that's very possible. Maybe that cat was grabbing onto a toy and somebody replaced it with a beer. Anyways. Here's, toy uh, beer. here's I guess, our last meme of the evening. Maybe before that one we can drop a plug. <laughs> I don't always watch you stream, but when I do, I watch an evening with Piss and Chris. Damn straight. Thanks, most interesting guy. America, why you no like an evening with Piss and Chris on Facebook? Why you no press like button on an evening with Piss and Chris? Why you no watching an evening with Piss and Chris? You watching an evening with Piss and Chris if you're watching right now, so we applaud that. Thank you, America. 
That's right. We are just ecstatic that you're watching. So stoked. You love an evening with Chris and Piss. I mean, Piss and Chris. Am I fucking that up? Anyways. This kid's farting again in the studio. Just tearing some up. <laughs> All right. Our last, uh, our last meme of the night. What is it? What do we got? We got a uh, Will Smith, Fresh Prince of Bel Air. Oh, shit. Doing the toe step. Will Smith, toe step. Smell that, dude? Oh, Christ. This kid's waving that fart into my face. Ass ah, it. Try it to a different song. Is this our evening montage? Our gift montage? that time of night everybody it's been a f- another fantabulous evening with uh Fitz and chris heck yeah really enjoyed this um i feel like we really touched on some issues <laughs> yeah we really broke in uh, did some uh did some boundary cross social change and uh bettering of mankind oh yeah all the way around the world not afraid to do it. Got two fingers up those dangerous issues. So I hope you enjoyed uh, some of the uh, the new gifts we've added to the arsenal. Once again, to go over some contact information, the uh, best way to get a hold of us is at evening with Piss and Chris at gmail.com. Visit us at Facebook by going to Facebook and typing in an evening with Piss and Chris. You can also go to Ustream.tv and type in an evening with Piss and Chris to watch us live. And you can tweet us by tweeting at AEW Piss Award and Chris.